Hi everyone, Dr. Mike here. In this video, I want to talk to you about carbohydrates in under two minutes. So, carbo means carbon, hydrates means water, which is hydrogen and oxygen. So all carbohydrates are, are carbons, hydrogens and oxygens. Now I'm going to talk to you about monosaccharides, which are the most simplest sugars, disaccharides, which are two sugars snapped together, and polysaccharides, which are many sugars snapped together, mainly the way that sugar is stored. So let's first start with the monosaccharides. There are three types. Glucose, fructose, and galactose. All of them have the same chemical formula, C6H12O6. Now you might say, well, if they've got the same chemical formula, what's the difference? Why do they have different names? It's simply the arrangement of the C6H12O6. The other thing is that we use the glucose to form ATP energy through the glycolytic pathway. Fructose and galactose also feed into that glycolytic pathway. So when you ingest fructose and galactose, most of it's going to feed into that glycolytic pathway for energy. Now, if you were to take glucose and snap it together with a fructose, you form a disaccharide called sucrose. If you take glucose and snap it together with a galactose, you get lactose, the most common sugar in milk. And if you get two glucose molecules and snap them together, you get maltose. Fructose and galactose snap together doesn't actually form anything in nature. So they're the disaccharides, maltose, sucrose, and lactose. Now, how do we store sugar? Well, meat stores sugar in the form of glycogen. So us as humans and animals will store their sugars in the form of glycogen. They're just a bunch of glucose molecules snapped together. Plants will store glucose in the form of cellulose and starch. Now cellulose, you can see that the bonds alternate and the alternating bonds we can't break. So we can't actually utilize the sugar in cellulose. This is what's in grass, for example. But starch, we can because all the bonds go in the same direction and we can break it. Starch and glycogen are very similar. And this is a quick run through of carbohydrates.